Yo, why the hell did you call me 14 times and leave me 35 text messages in five minutes? I have an idea. Fuck, not again. You're gonna wanna sit down for this one. Ah, uh, dude, just hurry it up, because I gotta go back to work soon. Hey! You can't rush, Art. Time out. Is that a selfie stick? Yes, Brandon, yes, it's a freaking selfie stick, okay? Why? I couldn't go to the store to pick up an actual pointer because someone used all our funds to buy that Lego bag. Yeah, that was you. I specifically remember that being you. Okay, Continue. listen, listen. I'm onto something big, huge, revolutionary. Generations after generations, centuries after centuries, eons after eons. Okay, hurry it up! The habit of fidgeting has consumed the minds of society. Flashback to 5000 BC when time never existed and students were stuck in school for 30, 40 hours a day. No. No, that's completely inaccurate. Can you please just shut the hell? I, this took me four and a half hours to make. The least you can do is just listen. Fine, fine. Listen, you know, the only way students can relieve their stress and boredom... Leg shakes. Leg shaking? Yeah. You know when you're sitting down, your leg just starts shaking furiously, and you just can't stop, like, all the muscle, the cartilage, and fat, just all unite in one to create this jello-ness, like, jello on Oh, okay, hot. okay, get on, that's gross, what? get on with it. What? It was... That, that was just fucking gross. I'm sorry, I got too into it. Clearly. Okay, listen, but anyway, leg shaking. You know, it pissed off your neighbors, you'd be at risk for hurting your knee, and it'll cause all sorts of problems. Until one fine day, a scientist by the name of Albert Einstein created what is known today as the pencil. Uh, Albert Einstein definitely did not create the pencil. Dude! I'm literally describing one of the most scientific revolutionary breakthroughs of all time. You're such a pessimist and all you can think about is a freaking pencil. I'm literally just saying that- Al Shut up! Okay. Pencil tapping. This was probably the longest lasting fidgeting trend. You know, students would tap their pencils on everything. You know, their books, their friends, their friends' books, their desks. Okay, where is this going? So? This all changed when something crazy emerged and changed the game forever. Tech decks. Shit. Listen, scientists discovered a way to shrink a skateboard into the palm of your hands. Incredible. Some 21st century type shit. Tech decks were easily the dopest things on the market. You know, they were used by everyone. I'm talking teens. I'm talking babies. I'm talking adults. I'm talking dogs. You, you just had to have one. I mean, Whenever students would get stuck on a question in school or simply need to relieve some stress, they would not hesitate to engage in pure skateboarding swagger. I mean, they would hit tricks off of anything. And I mean anything. Okay, what is the point of any of this? You didn't let me finish. That's why there's a question mark here. What next? I'll tell you what's next. Habit rotators. Habit rotators? Habit rotators. Imagine you have a bearing, right? About yay big. About like this big, with not one, not two, not four, not five, but three hooves. Hooves? Hooves. You know, sometimes the French say hooves, which might be the miscommunication here. Yeah, yeah, sure, that might be it. All right, but anyway, students can literally put it in between their fingers and spin it all they want. And that could relieve their fidgeting, their stress, their depression, their AIDS, their cancer. Listen, the habit rotator is the next big thing. And I think we should follow the roads our brothers paid for us. And I think this is the answer. What do you think? Fidget spinners. Fidget spinners. I like that name. No, no, like that, that's not like a name for you to use. They're already a thing. Like the habit, it's- No, no habit, no rotators, just fidget, just spinners. It's already a thing. Like, I can't believe you haven't seen these before. This thought, like, no, I spin. No, like, no, like, I guess you're just living under a rock, Patrick. Like, I, dude, I even have mine. How have you not seen these before? Let me see this. No, this is completely different. You're an idiot. Come on. Nothing not the same as scooping out shit from the asshole. <laughs> it's it's the getting same. lit out of your belly button, okay? Bro, it's the same shit. Bro, it's dry skin. Not I don't give a fuck about your goddamn lit, Brandon. <laughs>